Hi guys, from past one video, I am working on a uh, CSS3 responsive drop down menu. You can see here, this and this one is also responsive. Uh, so, let us go to our editor and start adding uh, our uh, style. Just before that, I want to show how in my last video I had created this list, and in this video, I will apply CSS to it I'll come here and let us uh, remove some margin and padding default margin and padding from our HTML elements uh, remove default margin and padding just star red star then set padding as 0 pixel and margin as 0 pixel ok now let's style this container ok let us press margin 0 auto and give it a border of 1 so it's solid grey okay. and now if I come to my set C by giving this this margin as zero auto actually i am bringing my container in middle as you know our container's width is 960 pixel as it comes from a get skeleton or a skeleton framework and uh, i am taking 960 pixel for that container and leaving equal space on both the sides on left and right okay now let us style our style this one this navigation okay, and give it some margin okay, so let us give it a margin of 50 pixel at top and 10 pixel at the right 0 pixel at bottom and 10 pixel at left now when i refresh you will see our navigation menu has moved a bit down now just remove this border okay and now now we have to come to this uh, ul uh, we have to style this with using menu class Okay, right down. Oh, sorry, menu and list under that menu. First, okay. just right here only. Display and line block set position as relative float left and Right. Uh, first let me first explain this to you guys so you see guys I am making position as relative because I want my sub menu to display under this menu that's why I am making this list this top list as relative and I am uh, I'm using float as left because I want to uh, display our list in horizontal way okay just see by writing float left I am bringing this each menu item side by side ok now let us give some margin margin right 1 pixel you can see it will, I have given a slight margin to it now let us style our a tag menu list a Yes, we have to traverse our list from top ul to a 
okay now i have started from ul that's uh, i have used menu class for ul so i started with menu i come uh, to list now i am going to a in this traverse uh, you have to traverse list like this which uh, which uh, i am uh, styling here okay so let's do some style to a tag font size uh, let us say 13 pixel and background color as rgb okay 233 191 and 139 is okay okay now let us make our text display uh, in uppercase text transform uppercase text text okay text transform in uppercase and line height 43 pixels let us give it some padding 0 at top and bottom and 14 pixels oh sorry 14 pixel at left and right now enter then letter spacing is point zero eight m okay now font weight I'm going to keep it as bold then give it a color of uh, white and display it as block don't worry guys I will explain you this all these things text decoration as none okay now save it and come to your page you, have see, you can see this our uh, navigation menu is exactly looking like this okay as in my next video I will explain you all these things and I will continue this tutorial to add an active link here and I will start adding uh, this uh, sub menu here okay okay I will see you in my next video guys I hope you enjoy this video if you like this video please do subscribe and thanks for watching